Hello Fastmatic friends, thank you, thank you very much for subscribing to our channel because with that we can continue making videos of all subjects in math to learn math from zero. Today we're going to study a subject that is a little bit strange. How to calculate a percent of a percent. Let's see one example. At the Union Middle School, 40% of the boys play basketball. Of the boys who play basketball, 10% are 6th graders. The question is, what percent of the boys are 6th graders playing basketball? So first of all, we have to understand very, very well this problem. First, we have 100% of boys. Imagine that here we have 100 boys. Of those 100, we see that 40% of them are playing basketball. Boys. For every 100 boys, 40 play basketball. Now imagine we are zooming this section. If we zoom that square, we're going to see that we can imagine 100 percent of this square and then we see that for every 100 players we are going to have only 10 10 percent that are sixth graders but the question is if this square means 40 percent this 10% is like almost nothing here, 10%. The question is, this 10%, what percent is of the total of boys at the Union Middle School? So remember that all percent problems can be solved using rule of three. And this case is not an exception. We're going to write percent here and represents in percentage here. So the 40% here represents the 100% of this square. Now, if we take not 100 but only 10% of this square, what percentage of the original amount is going to be? What percentage of boys is going to be? So remember that the rule of three can be solved multiplying the numbers that have a couple in diagonal and the answer will be divided by the number that doesn't have a couple in diagonal. Then we're going to write x is equal to 40 times 10 divided by 100. And the answer is 4%. Only 4%. That means that for every 100 boys at Union Middle School, Four boys are sixth graders. But wait, we have another method, a very fast method. When in math you see that someone tells something of something. That means multiplication. 10% of 40% means of is 
multiplication. We are going to multiply 10% by 40%. But we are going to write it in a decimal form. 0.10 times 0.40. And we get 0.04. That is 4%. Remember that always, if you want to convert a decimal number to percentage, you have to move the decimal point two places to the right. And that's it. Thank you very much for your attention. See you next time.